Hi, I'm Mike. I'm Becky. And we're here with the Mike and Becky Show. We're at the Lincoln Highway Experience, uh, Experience uh, Museum, and we're eating right now in a 1930s dining car. And our friend Andy is going to tell you a little bit about that car. Hey, Andy, what can you tell us? Hi, folks. This diner was built in 1938 in New Jersey, and it was brought to Irwin, Pennsylvania, which is a little bit west of here, uh, and set on a foundation, and it sat there providing... Uh, food to travelers from 1938 to 1958, at which time they were so successful they expanded and bought a new diner. But this diner then was moved to a new location where it was operated for 40 years, eventually was sold or, or donated to the History Center in Pittsburgh, sat in a warehouse for a decade, and then it was offered to us. Uh, we gladly accepted it. There was no money to, to buy it, but we spent half a million dollars restoring it. Wow. But it's a, a beautiful dollars. relic of yesteryear, and we welcome all of you to come here and have a slice of pie and a cup of coffee with us, and uh, hope you can visit us sometime. Thanks, Andy. Hey, and I'll tell you what, that pie was fantastic, too. And uh, so there is a question here with 1938, how much did this thing cost to build? It's a 16 stool, four booth diner. Was it? Eleven thousand seven hundred and thirty dollars, eighteen thousand five hundred dollars, fifteen thousand four hundred twenty-five dollars, or twenty thousand one hundred thirty dollars. What do you think, Becky? You know what? Uh, I'm gonna go for the fifteen thousand four hundred twenty-five dollar. Okay, I'm going to go with the $11,000 one. I think it was probably there. You are right, Mike. All right. <laughs> and the most hey. interesting all thing right. is that when this diner was delivered, it came with all the silverware, dishes, cookware, really everything but the Holy food. Holy cow. Isn't that interesting? Wow, that's a deal. And this is this is still absolutely beautiful. You it feel is. like you just stepped back in time. Yep, there you go. I'm going to, I can't turn it around and still shoot, I don't think. But yeah, it's got Mexican, Mexican mahogany. And you know, stainless steel and uh, marble countertop. Marble countertops. Yep. It's these gorgeous. would have been. We've we've never figured out whether these were hot plates or cold plates. But there's uh, <laughs> copper tubing running through here to okay. keep it either hot or cold. We're not sure what it was. Well, maybe either. And we understand that these were not original. Okay. These were where the jukeboxes were. Oh wow! But the second owner of the diner, they took the jukeboxes out and they replaced them with these hot and cold plates. But I could imagine, with covers on here, you might keep the things you would use frequently, like mashed potatoes or sure. baked beans or peas yeah. or something. Okay. Uh, these are coolers. This down was here. the grill. Okay. This is where the cold food was kept. Down there, mm -hmm. we have uh, uh, coffee makers and, and places for uh, soup. Tr soup hot, and hot, yeah, hot hot plates where we could have soup and things like that. Wow. Uh, so it. It's a great throwback to yesteryear. Yeah, it's fantastic. Thanks for sharing with us, Tony. And, Very good uh, to meet you, I hope everybody Mike. comes down and checks out the museum. Great, thank you. Have a uh, wonderful trip and okay. safe travels. All right, and that's, that's, that's it for this episode of the Mike and Becky Show. Join us later. We're back Bye. on the road. <laughs>